Sarah Khavi and uh, she is asking a question highlighting what is required in training our people on data analysis skills and importance of calculated decision making oh definitely that's that's an excellent question they will hence value the importance of data they're working on and i think you you rightly mentioned susan in one of the points that culture knowledge awareness is more than the systems that are yeah. managing the data so it's an excellent question thank you lara for raising that question over to you susan on this particular point yeah actually so she's raised a great thing uh shameless plug of the book again between spreadsheets but i have in here i created something called the data coat and it's basically make sure your data has its coat on like a jacket and the first thing is and this can be this this will be universally recognized by anyone from this the receptionist in the building up to the CEO. So first of all make sure your data is consistent. So let's use the same date formats, the same units of measure, the same terminology, the same process. Make sure everyone's doing it the same way. Then of course your data needs to be organized. So think about do you need to have it by country, by region, by business unit, by business company, by person? Have that all categorized in the data and ready to go so that when someone asks you the question, how much did we sell in the UK last week? You can just pull that data right out. Then of course it's got to be accurate. Now, to find what accurate is within your different business area. Obviously finance you need 100% accurate data, but in other areas it might be about uh, making sure that when you're setting up a product you have the unit of measure and material type. The name is formatted correctly. So once you have your consistent, your organized and your accurate data, guess what? It's going to be trustworthy. And that's what we're all looking for. So all the time I hear about lack of trust in the data. So I tell everyone, make sure that you put your data coat on, but also once it's on, make sure it stays on all year round. No matter how hot it gets outside, keep the data coat on all year round. Interesting points. Uh, good questions coming in. I'm getting a lot of refresher. But with that, you know, the, the biggest question a lot of people have is chat GPT going to take my job if no. I am a data analyst? Yeah, no, no, no. In fact, you know, we're we're experimenting with it and in, in several cases it's going to enhance or make our job more efficient. But again, you have to check the output, check where that source is coming from, because what, you know, it's coming from the from the internet and not everything on the internet is true so you just have to be very careful 